This looks insane. Look at this, man. What? What is that? Here it is, baby. That is mine. A hover tank. In the year 2351, the advent discovery of teleportation revolutionizes transportation within the solar system. Despite its inherent flaws and egregious energy demands, this control tearing of space-time leads to the colonization of a terrestrial planet orbiting Proxima Centauri, the nearest star to our own. Moved by the deep red hues of its dwarf star, the people name their new home Centaurus after the constellation within which it resides. Infrastructure is established between the people of Sol and the determined Centauri. An era of peaceful and prosperous existence for humanity begins. Yet, it would not last for long. Countless drones are dispatched to explore the vast expanse beyond. But the fundamental nature of teleportation results in a destination that is deeply drawn toward gravity wells such as planets, stars, and black holes. Despite all efforts, none return. Dreams of exploring deep space are thwarted by a lack of progress, and the project is eventually shut down. However, on an unlikely winter day, years after its departure, a single dusty drone returns. Hailing from a region beyond the galaxy core, the recovery of this unlikely traveler surmounts to nothing less than a miracle, leading to the discovery of Balterus, a seemingly barren planet scorched in the blinding light of its host star. With the teleportation link stable, expeditions are mounted, and mankind, at the cusp of making first contact, explores the sandy wastes. As the curious adventurers saw it, a discovery is indeed made, but not one they had expected. Deep inclusions within seemingly benign crystals of silica glisten in the star's brilliant light, casting a vivid sapphire hue which ensnares their curious eyes. This element would come to be known as Balterium, and is soon lauded as the greatest finding in human history. Samples are taken, experiments are made, and the material achieves the impossible, multiplying input energy by several orders of magnitude without a significant loss in mass, as well as manipulating the matter around it in ways that remain poorly understood. It does not take long for extensive mining to begin, but Baltrus had one more revelation to unveil. From the amber hues of the vast dunes, a plethora of crab-like creatures emerge, unimpressed by the colossal machines and reaping the soils of their home. They attack with ferocious power, cutting down the machine, forcing the reinstatement and deployment of a vast military arm. With the creatures at bay, the Valterium spoils are enjoyed by the overindulged populace of Sol, with little trickling through to the proud Centauri. Despite the greatest of political efforts, appeals fall on deaf ears, precipitating the inception of their own mining enterprise, laying the foundations for conflict. As mining intensifies and relations wither, humanity is once more cast down the path of war. Within a year, the bloodshed begins. Damn, guys. What a introduction to this mental game. Here we are. Look at this. So, Silica's a crossover of FPS and RTS. We're up to three factions battle for control over the planet of Balterus. Lead from above is commander or experience the action firsthand, either alone or or with friends, join one of the two human armies, or hunt them down as the territorial aliens. So you play one of the two armies, or the aliens. Look at this little crab thing down there next to a destroyed tank. This looks insane. So we're just going to give it a whirl today and see what we're doing. Strategy, Prospector, Arena. Select your favorite unit and face off in the unbalanced FPS free for all. No way. Battle for dominance in FPS or RTS in the flagship game mode of Silica. 
and explore the dusty waste in search of Baltium in this FPS mode. Oh, I don't know what to do. Let's do this one. This is proper. This is strategy. Rift Basin, City of Naraka, the Great Urge, or Badlands. So I guess we'll start in the Rift Basin, situated in mild northern latitudes. This location's welcoming charm is uh, countered by the sheer cliffs and deep chasms. Uh, make a transportation within the area of a series of detours. On the flip side, the region is known for its rich Baltimore reserves. So this is going to be my uh, single player only. And I'm going to jump in to the Rift Basin and figure this out. I love real-time strategy games. I play a lot of Total War. And uh, honestly, I haven't played like Command & Conquer for ages. And I think one of them did the first person RTS one. This is one developer as well. This is Bohemia Interactive. These are the guys that bought, um, you, bought you the Armour series. So you know it's going to look good. Um... But it's sort of their crowdfunded thing or whatever. Humans versus humans. Humans versus aliens. Humans versus humans versus aliens. So we want humans versus aliens, don't we? And we're going to play as humans. Sol. And. So you can choose the infantry or the commander. So I'm going to be the commander. But I guess I can zoom down into the infantry. So in a command and conquer fashion. This is the map. It's all greyed out. We have to search around the map. Oh my god. It feels so familiar because of all the RTS and stuff. Right, so you got the commander mode or the infantry mode. Look at this in infantry mode, man. This looks insane. The graphics are awesome. Oh, and I can do that. Okay. So I switched. I press T. And I can go infantry. Is this and this is the same game? Yeah, 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 because they're all moving over there. Oh wow. Alright, 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 alright. Let's get the boys. Look at this harvester, man. This thing is absolutely massive. So that's gonna go by. Can't we just use that and just charge it into bugs? So that's gonna get oh yeah, this silica. Okay, so we just leave that to get our monies. We've got 2,500 points at the minute. I'm back here to defend against the bugs when they inevitably become. So what we got here, right. This is the headquarters. This is the refinery. You don't need to do anything from the refinery. The harvester just goes back and drops us off the ref uh, resources. Right, barracks. What have we got? I don't know what these are yet. We're going to wait till it's finished because we might already have uh, a light vehicle factory, refinery and barracks. I think that's everything. We need more silica, which is what that is getting. And I can jump out and into a... Uh, person and then I can get in like quads and tanks and different stuff as a soldier which is pretty cool right research facility upgrade the facility to level mark one I right, can't afford to do that currently and scout or rifleman so I can make these two three fifty how much are these fifty points so we can stack them up there in the queue uh, we do need the light vehicle thing now how much is that three thousand so we have to wait for this refinery to get into there. It's, he's not having a great time. All right, radar station's being built, this one. All right, another, let's do a couple of snipers. The big one comes with screwed because we haven't got any light uh, vehicles at the minute. Ah, uh, okay. Research facility silo. Yeah, yeah, light vehicles. So we actually need 3K, so we can't do anything until the 3K is made. Oh, what is that dropping off? That's dropping off a group of men, not just one at a time. See, they're scouts. Okay, cool. Let's have a look at my loadout. Scout or rifleman. I think I'd rather keep this for now. Looks like we're all off to attack these things now. There's the hunter. Look at that thing. No way, dude. There's someone else as well. Attack the impaler. Brad, the impaler's over there, man. Where's that thing? Right, I'm going in as the commander. What we got? Dropping off the stuff, Harvester. I need a light quad. And I'm going to switch back and just let him do what he's doing. Here we go. I'm going to get in a vehicle. I will. Where's the enemies at? Okay, there's something in front of me. Two of them. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. There it is. What is that thing, man? 
They're tiny. Oh, oh yeah. Take that bug. Not oh, bloody Starship Troopers. Oh, great rounds over there. Let's check the map. Oh yeah, there's loads of stuff coming. Uh, oh wow. You got two um, harvesters over there fighting over who's gonna go put their <laughs> thing in. Still up here. Whoa, that's a big one. Ah, uh, we landed in low silica. Oh, man. I want to cool down. Yeah, get wrecked. We've got all the troops out here, man. Uh, what's next? Big boy over here. Oh, we've got to avoid this. It's hard to see. Yeah, yeah, it's a scorpion. You're getting absolutely lit up here. Look at this, man. What? <laughs> You don't know how much you need an RTS FPS until you play one. That is taking some punishment. Honestly, look at all the stuff firing at it. Uppish backed off. And it's still alive. We found actually a bug base over there. In the direction I'm facing. Oh, let me just pop back here a sec. Light quads have been made. We've got zero. Right, claimed. If you just actually look at something and press E, you claim it. It will stop and then you can just get in. Amazing. Stop you chasing down the vehicles. What's been built over here? So much stuff coming. Light quads have been made. We must have dropped off some silica. The AI commander's taken over. Back to defend the heavy vehicle factory. Heavy vehicle factory? Yeah, we need this built. Let's head over and help the boys. Look at this thing, a Humvee. Claimed, please. Thank you. Wow. That's a big boy, and there's an even bigger boy behind it. Oh, that actually got done in. I mean, I think I helped a little bit. What's the troop situation? Uh, there's a couple of small ones on the other end there. Light quads engaging. There's a big one over here, but we need to stop the bugs coming. I don't see his health going down. Uh, I don't think I can get this. Oh, no, that is... <gasps> We, we're taking a little bit of help of it. Um, we need bigger vehicles. No. I'm honestly, I'm going to head back and try and get a tank. Oh, no. What is that? What just got me? This is insane. I'm loving it. Those bullets were just bouncing off that Goliath. What are you? Let's go. Let's actually go. Get in here. Let's go. We got it. Oh, yes. Right, machine gun. And that is what I'm talking about. Head towards the red things. What is that building now? This AI is insane. You keep doing you, mate. We'll have a look what they are soon, man. We'll jump into the commander hotspot after this uh, tank gets destroyed. Oh, wow. Look at that. It's an APC, dude. Look at that thing. Get absolutely wrecked. What's shooting me? Oh, get absolutely done in. Don't like the range stuff. 
There are the scorpions firing from the tails. Oh my god, that did the tank in so quick. Oh, we are engaging all sorts of hostiles. What are these dudes over here for, man? Come back and defend. It's a heavy armoured car. We weren't even in a tank. It was a heavy armoured car. Scout rifleman, marksman. Heavy. Yes, please. That means we're going to be able to change our loadout now. Mark 3. Greatest facility to Mark 3. Can we do that? 3,000. We've got... Yes, we can. What's this? I don't know what this is. Uh, ultra Heavy Vehicle Factory. I'm guessing that's what that is. We'll find out in a second. Yeah, get some more heavy out there. We'll go and change our loadout to heavy in a minute. Radar station doing its job. That's upgrading the facility now. What is going in here, boys? I don't even know. Let me see. What's this ultra heavy vehicle thing? So that can do a harvester currently. Um, okay, I mean, that's a good thing. Oh, commando. Elite soldiers not to be messed with. Brutal Baltarian rifles. Tank. Yes, that's mine. And then a rocket launcher after. Right, we're going to switch to bloke and wait for this... We've got tanks and all sorts flying around here now. APCs. Here it is, baby. That is mine. A hover tank. Holy crap, man. Look at this thing. Oh, wow. Now we're talking. And it moves. Now we're in a tank. Oh, there's a big dude over here. Oh, yes. Whatever big one was over there, I think just died. I'm going to go straight to their enemy base in this thing. Little tiny crab. No problem. Who are you? Getting absolutely smashed, boys. That's the one that fires. They are a pain in the ass. That got absolutely done in. You're good, aren't you, boys, with that thing? Yes, you are. Right. Head over here. There's just an army of them coming, man. I'm taking damage now. Armour's on half. God damn it. Wow, it ate that. We're going to stay and defend the boys while the building gets done. Man, I wonder what else they can build. Yes. Right, half health tank. I'm going to see if I can at least have a glimpse of their base. Quarter health. <laughs> Not getting done in by that. They are sending out. They must have some stuff here. It's around here. I'm going to go around the back. We're going on the offensive because this light armoured car is coming with me. <laughs> and a heavy quad. All right, we're coming around now. What is this? Great spawning cyst. Sounds absolutely lovely. Let's give that some beans. Come on, boys. That's nearly done in. Quantum Cortex. How the hell have they got that? Oh, ha, ha. they're like us destroying your base, dear. I think I've got more chance of getting this. This is just called a nest. 
You can open up the bomb on your way out if you're leaving, mate. Tank is dealing some mental damage here, and it's lasted so long. There's probably more of these flying about now. Let's go. We absolutely smashed them. Yes, boys, we took it with the air. Uh, the hover quad to their base and absolutely wrecked them. Their mistake was sending them all over to us. They could have had a pretty good defense there. That was amazing. That was amazing. We've got to play as another faction. We've got to play as uh, the aliens themselves. I just go and smash up a human base. How sick is that going to be? All the different maps. Boys, amazing. Put down in the comments below what you think to this. It's early access as well. One developer... Absolutely awesome. Bohemia Incubator is the developer and the publishers Bohemia Interactive. Most positive over on Steam. Silica looks absolutely amazing. Mind blown. Love RTSs. Love FPSs. Put them together. You've got a sick game. Thanks for watching, guys. Like and sub for more content. I'll see you in the next one. Peace. I think the girls with their nails done.